I'm here at Camp Perry, Ohio for the CMP National Matches. I'm here with Mark Johnson, Deputy Chief Officer of the CMP Matches, to give us a little background and history about what these matches contain and do. Mark? The national matches at Camp Perry were first started in 1906. The Civilian Marksmanship Program was formed in 1903 by Teddy Roosevelt. The purpose of the Civilian Marksmanship Program is basically to teach civilians how to safely handle firearms and be proficient in marksmanship with an emphasis on youth. Um, the matches here at Camp Perry um, are the culmination of that in that uh, they're the mecca for rifle marksmanship in the United States. Uh, we have competitors compete all over the United States and they come to Camp Perry to compete in the national venue as a uh, culmination event to what they've practiced and, and uh, their performance throughout the year. So as I've been walking around, I see civilians, I see military, potentially law officers, so it seems, seems like you have a, a wide range of folks competing. We do. We have uh, young and old, uh, male, female, uh, civilian, and uh, armed forces, law enforcement, as you well pointed out, uh, firemen uh, from all walks of life, uh, all ages. Uh, we accept them all. Uh, they're all here for a singular purpose, and that's to compete in the matches. Thank you very much, sir. Right. What makes this year really special for us at Leatherwood Hilux Optics is the debut of this. The Malcolm 8X USMC Sniper Scope. And while I was at the range, I met some incredible people, like Nick Meadows, a Marine and three-time Purple Heart recipient. I also learned more about a group called Adapt and Overcome, who helps wounded veterans through marksmanship. I've got a separate interview with Nick and the Adapt and Overcome leadership in a separate video that you can see. Now, how did this perform, you may ask? I'll let you find out from the shooters. There's really only one word to explain, explain the 600 yard line, surgical. This thing shoots like a house of fire. I'm loving the scope, uh, crystal clear. I'm Nick with Hornaday. We're here at the, the CMP, uh, Camp Perry. Um, we shot the vintage sniper match yesterday. We were shooting a uh, Remington 1941A1 with uh, the Hilux, the Malcolm 8 Power Scope, uh, and it performed absolutely beautiful for us. Uh, the, the optics are as clear as they can be, the crosshair is just the right size, not too big, not too small, and it, uh, it, it worked flawlessly for us, no, no problems at all. Um, I shot a really good score, I shot uh, uh, 97 on the 300 and 97 on 6, so it, uh, it definitely, we had very good equipment, and, uh, great ammunition of course, and everything worked out uh, just as perfectly, perfect as it could be. Hi, I'm Ben Searing with Hornady Manufacturing here at the CMP uh, Games here in Camp Perry, Ohio. Um, we had a great time. Uh, shooting Hornady ammunition, 168 grain Amax ammo for the M1 Grand. It's actually the M1 Grand ammo. Uh, we backed up to 600 with my partner Nick here, and uh, we were shooting the 1941, uh, and we had one of those Malcolm optics on there. Performed very well. Shot my personal best. My partner, who's a better shot than I did, shot a 97, which I think is great, only dropping three points at 600 yards. Had a little bit of a crosswind, but. The 168 bucked the wind very well for us, and the combination with the scope and the rifle was just great. Your equipment's going to help. Cease fire! I'm serious, because I'm going to utilize that equipment to the best of its abilities. Because a lot of guys, and, and we got a couple of veterans out here already, that the first time they ever shot, they're not on paper, they're getting discouraged. Put them behind my gun with that scope on it, that Malcolm scope, and have them work from the five ring into the X ring and you can see their whole world light up. I have one guy uh, during the Central Games in Oklahoma, he got behind my rifle and after that he was like, dude, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go run 10 miles. 
the biggest problem shooting at 600 yards is getting distracted by the the, the shot spotter from the previous round. Um, the, the optics are that good. Uh, you can read Mirage. Um, I don't even miss my spotting scope back there. And like I said, when it's on, it will shoot tens and X's all day long. I like it. It shoots real well. The barrel on this one's a 1930 dated barrel. Who made this rifle? Me. Oh. I put it together. So. I think uh, this one, if you know how to use the scope, I think uh, this is a lot of better than the original. I mean, the clarity and the accuracy, we, 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 every scope we test right. on the optical Collimeter system. Okay. Travels very precise. I'd like that gentleman said it. Right. That goes back to where you, you what, want. Where, yeah, yeah. 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 I'm. I'm happy with. It. I'm. I'm pleased as punch. Uh, I really am. For more information about the CMP and national matches, visit www.thecmp.org. Thank you for watching.